you're going to get hell fire. You won't be proud and haughty there. You're not going to flatter God, I'll tell you that. You're not going to flatter God. You're going to be destroyed. You're going to be in a roast. This is God's love. This is God's love. This is God's love. The fear of the Lord's to hate. The fear of the Lord's to hate evil. The Bible said hate the evil of the good. Right. You look like a demon. Yeah, you're definitely a God, God loves yeah, He hates all workers of iniquity. Oh, there it is. There's the truth. Yeah. There's Psalm 5-5 five, five for you. Don't reject that one. Don't reject that one, woman. God doesn't love you just the way you are. If he did, you wouldn't have to be. You wouldn't have to repent. If God loved you just the way you were, you wouldn't have to stop being you. You wouldn't have to stop being you, fat, rebellious, fat, rebellious, and stubborn. Fat, rebellious, and stubborn, clamorous, loud, a feminist pig. That's what you are. Time to repent. Time to repent. Yeah, that's Bible, people. That's Bible. I know that God didn't send some little limp-wristed, skinny jean wearing sissy out here to tell you the truth. Excuse me? Some little limp-wristed, skinny jean wearing sissy. Are you a fag? That was pretty flamboyant. Are you homosexual? Yes, I am. Exactly. And my God that's loves me problem. the way I am. God's going to put you in hell, bud. No, he's not. He loves me You're the way I am. I was born this You're way. You're a child of the devil. You're no, I am not. I, I am born again. I am a Christian man. Again. I'm a born again. Okay, I was born this way. So fuck you and fuck you. I am not a pervert. You can kiss my goddamn ass. Sorry, I'd rather not. I'm not a homo. I would. I am. I know you are. I know you are. God can make you straight again. God can make you straight again. No, he will not. You don't have to be a pervert. He made me this way. You don't have to be a pervert. I was born in his image. Well, yeah, but you need to be born again. Jesus Christ lived with 12 men. If you were born again, you wouldn't be a fat. Okay. Pretty straightforward. Oh. If you were born again, you wouldn't be a faggot. You would be straight. That's a hate crime. You would be That's straight. That's a hate crime right Repent. there. Repent. That's a hate crime. Repent. That's a hey, hate you crime. don't like to go move to North Korea, That's fag. A hate crime. You don't like to go move to South Korea, faggot. You don't like to go move to Russia, you faggot. You don't like it. Go move to Afghanistan. Try being a faggot in Afghanistan. Try being a faggot in Saudi Arabia. Try being a faggot in the Middle East. See how far it goes. They might throw you off a building in the Middle East. They would take a faggot like you and throw you off a building in the Middle East. You child of the devil. You want to know why you don't like it? Because you're not supposed to be that way. You want to know why you don't like it? Because you're not supposed to be that way. And you know it. God's not going to send a little uh, pulpit pen. God's not going to send you a pulpit pen to come lie to you. Oh, he doesn't make any mistakes. I agree. You choose to make mistakes. You choose to be a fag. You choose to do that which is against nature. You're going to go to hell, sir. When are you going to wake up, buddy? When are you going to wake up? Oh, I've been awake a long time now. Jesus Christ set me free. Jesus Christ gave me a newness of life. Jesus Christ pulled my heart out of stone and he gave me a heart of flesh. Jesus Christ set me in my right mind. Jesus Christ taught me how to love what he loves and hate what he hates. Jesus Christ filled me with his spirit. I've been renewed by the trans transforming of my mind. I've been renewed in the spirit of my mind. I'm seeing things just right. And when I look at this place, I see it just the way God does. God hates this building. God hates this den of devils. God hates all the events that go on in this filthy place. God hates every single event this filthy place holds. It's nothing more, nothing less than idolatry for you people. These are your gods. This is who you worship. You're going to be in the same hell with the Scientologist. You're going to be in the same hell with the Catholic. You're going to be in the same hell with the Jehovah's Witness. You're going to be in the same hell with the drunkard, with the fornicating whore, with the fornicating whoremonger. You're going to be in the same hell with the Buddhist. You're going to be in the same hell with the porn watcher. 
You're gonna be in the same hell with the cigarette sucking sinners and the masturbating head baggage. You're gonna be in hell if you don't repent, if you don't surrender to Jesus Christ. You're gonna perish. Oh, that's the truth today. That's the truth today. That's the message. That's the hour of the time. Repent or perish. Judge not, let's keep you judged. Yeah, read Matthew down to verse 7. 5, hypocrite. Sorry? Read down to verse 5, hypocrite. You ever read verse 5 before? Or did you just stop at 1? See, what we do, how we read scriptures, we don't take a, a black marker and we don't just... Uh, delete everything on the page. You got to read down to verse 5. I took the plank out of my eye a long time ago. If you're coming out of there, you're condemned. You better repent. You better fear God. You better depart from your iniquity. The Bible says to judge righteous judgment. The Bible says a spiritual man judges all things. The Bible says God loves judgment. The Bible said evil men understand not judgment. You want to know why you don't like judgment? Because you're under the condemnation and wrath of God. That's the only reason why people don't like judgment. Because you're already condemned. You laugh now. You know it's true. You know it's true. What happened? See, you're not going to stand before God and try to stand upon Matthew 7, 1. You're not going to stand before God and try to stand upon Matthew 7, 1. No, the Bible says all Scripture is given of inspiration of God, is profitable for doctrine, for reproof, for correction, for instruction in righteousness, that the man of God may be perfect, thoroughly furnished unto all good works. Don't go in there. Stop living a lie. Stop living in sin. You don't have to get hell. You can get Jesus Christ. You can get forgiveness. You can get mercy. You can get the grace of God. You don't have to be a sodomite. You can be a saint. You can be a saint. You can be transformed. You can be forgiven. But you got to humble yourself. And that's the problem in America today. America's full of pride. That's why we parade faggots in our streets. That's why we have pride parades all throughout our nation. Because we're full of pride. You know what the Bible says about pride? It says, Pride goeth before destruction. Did you hear that, homos? Did you hear that homo prover? Did you hear that proud fake patriots? Pride goes before destruction. And a haughty spirit before repent. So question for you. God commanded you to repent. I know. Jesus commanded you guys to break bread with sinners. Last night checked. I know why God it time. repented you know God that he made man. Read your Bible. Read your Bible. I know why it repented God that he made fakes like you people. I know it repent why it repented God that God would create man and they would be confused like you, freak. Shame on you, woman. You're not gonna hell from hell. You're not gonna hell from hell, woman. Evil, wicked, adulterous. You're shameful. You're wicked. You're confused. You're a strange thing. You're going to die and go to hell. Fear God, buddy. Fear God. Fear God. You're perverse. You're vile. You're detestable. You're scum in the sight of God. It's time to repent. Time to repent. Time to repent, time to repent people. You're going to go to hell with your false God. You're going to burn in everlasting fire with your false gods. You're going to burn in the lake of fire. Because you reject the gospel, like you reject it. Jesus Christ, not going to like it there, wicked woman, witch. Not going to like it there. Shame on you. Shame on you people. You worship and serve the creature more than the creator who's blessed forever. Amen. You're confused. You're in a strong delusion. And you're going to burn under the fire of God's wrath. You're going to get the indignation of God. You're going to get the righteous judgment of God. You're going to get the fierce fury of God. You're going to get the anger and wrath of God. God's already angry with you. God is God angry with the me. wicked... No, he don't love you know. sucking on them filthy Newports. Cigarette sucking center. You're lucky he didn't give you cancer yet. You're lucky he ain't got cancer yet. You're lucky God didn't give you cancer. Because that's what God does to the rebellious. That's what God's going to do to the lesbians. He's going to burn them in hell. 
God puts abominable trash like you right into hellfire. God puts abominable filth like you right into hellfire. Because you change the truth of God into a lie. Because you go that which is against nature. Homosexuality is against nature. Homosexuality is an abomination. Homosexuality is perverse. Homosexuality is detestable. You better fear God, woman. Not much longer you're going to be dead. Not much longer you're going to be dead and in hell. Yeah, you just don't know where to go. Very confused. I know the Word of God is causing you. I know the Word of God puts people in derision. Amen. The Word of God's against you people today. Amen, bro. Amen. The Word of God's against you people today. Thus saith the Lord. He's going to bring evil upon you. He's going to slay the wicked. He's going to make those who hate the righteous desolate. You're going to be destroyed. God doesn't hear your prayers if you're going in there. Does he, are you going in there? Yeah, I, is that a, why can't you tell me the truth? Are you Christian? Uh, oh yeah, does God hear your prayers? Now, if you had to take that long to answer the question, he obviously don't. He obviously don't hear your prayers. Yeah, I don't think God hears your prayers. Are you a robot? Time for you to repent. Time for you to repent. Did you think about it? Did you read it? Did you read down to verse 5 yet? Did you read down to verse 5? Man, all that, you didn't read down to verse 5 yet, man. You know, that, that could be life or death right there for some of you people. If you read down to verse 5, a lot of you judge not people. A lot of you haters of judging. You know, I'm full of judgment because I'm full of the Holy Ghost. I'm full of judgment. God loves judgment. God rejoices in judgment. God's going to rejoice over you to destroy you. That's what it says in the book of Deuteronomy. Oh, he's going to wet his glittering sword. He's going to wet his glittering sword. He'll take vengeance on his adversaries and reward them that hate him. That hate him. Come out, devil, in the name of Jesus. Come out, devil, in the name of Jesus. Oh, yeah. He's going to reward them that hate him. He's going to repay you to your face to destroy you. He's going to repay you to your face to destroy you. Shame on you. You're lucky it's not a wheelchair. You're lucky it's just a cane and not a wheelchair. That might be next. Might be a hearse next for you. Might be a hearse next for you. You better fear God. I'm not a sodomite. Sorry, I, I deny your invitation. Sick pervert, wicked heathen. Repent. Repent. Repent therefore this thy wickedness. You're wicked. Repent therefore this thy wickedness. Pray God, you better pray God that perhaps the thought of thine heart may be forgiven me. Oh yeah. You better turn to Jesus Christ. Is that a man? You better turn to Jesus Christ. You better turn to the Lord Jesus Christ. Judgment day is not. Judgment day is not for you people. You're not ready. You're sleeping. You're sleeping on God's judgment. Man or a woman? Quit, can't tell. Man or a woman? Yep. Is that a man or a woman? What is that? That is my wife. Oh, yeah? Yeah? Really? Are you sure that's not a man? Shame on you. Shame on you. What will be unto your soul, filthy woman? Disgusting woman. You and your filthy finger. God's going to chop that finger off, spare that, and throw you into hellfire. You better fear God. Nobody's worried about you. Nobody's worried about a little limp wrist feather foot like you, buddy. I'm going to tell you that right now. What you need to worry about is God stomping you out. What a sad person. You need to get right with God, child. You have to be God. Enemy of all righteousness. You think somebody's scared of you, bud? Wait till God smashes your teeth out your ugly face. Reach in. Repent! Hey, repent! Your mom's a whore! Repent! 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 Your mom's a whore! Just like me! Repent! Oh, God. Repent in the, in the name of the faith, Jesus Christ! That's what a Jezebel is like you're gonna do. Yes! Just that's like your mom! Just like, like your mom! Your mom's a, a whore! Don't fall just down. like me! That's what, that's what I'm, you're a whore? You really? You're a whore? Is that you just said you're a whore? Yeah, I'm a whore just like 
like yeah, your mom. That's wicked. It's like your mom. You're a deep it's dick. Like your fucking You're mother. a strange, you ugly strange dick. Strange woman. Strange woman. I'm a strange you're, woman. Yeah, your steps stay cold on hell. Your steps stay cold on hell. Your steps stay cold on hell, wicked woman. Your house, your house leads to death. Preach it. Your house leads to hell fire. Preach it. Your house leads to everlasting fire. Amen. Amen. Your house leads down to the depths of hell. That's where it leads you, people. That's where it's going to lead you, people. You wicked people. Sinful and ungodly people. Abominable people. The freak show really came out tonight. Preach it. Looks like the trailer park got let out tonight. Preach That's it. What we got going on here in this filth water. Preach it. This place called filth water. More like blood water, Florida. Where the cops are corrupt. Where the cops sit in the gate for baby murder. Why are Clearwater corrupt cops getting arrested? Why are Clearwater cops strengthening the hand of the wicked? Why are Clearwater cops sitting in a gate of murder? You don't tell me what to do, Jezebel. You better get right with God. You better get right with God. You don't turn to Jesus Christ, you're going to end up in hell. I've been baptized. Oh, you're not living for Jesus going into that field. You're not living for Jesus going into that trash. It's time to repent. It's time to repent. The trailer park has been let out tonight in filth water, blood water, scum water, Florida. Full of the Church of Scientology, a habitation of devils, full of entertainment all over the place, dumbing the people down, bread and circuses sending you straight to hell. And God in his compassion and mercy sent three men to tell you to flee from the wrath to come. Flee from the wrath to come. Whoa! Be on the unity! Whoa! to your soul your soul you perish you perish you perish in your